Hey, what's up? Everybody, um, check this out. There's a list. This is a list of all the stuff that I need to update you guys on since the last video, which was number four. Um, that was actually over a year ago since I made the last video. I've been slacking. Um, this is what's going on now. So I almost have uh, more going on now, or as much as I did since the last video. Anyway, um, let's see. Since the last video, the last one was number four where Leslie from Miami came to couch surf in the car and we went to um, San Francisco and Yosemite. It was pretty cool, pretty fun. Um, so I came back in March. Uh, 2010, I was gone. January, February, and some of March. I came back like mid-March to Atlanta um, to hang out with uh, the girl that I was dating before I left, kind of, or way before I left. But anyway, good friends, so we're hanging out. And uh, my freaking laptop got stolen. I had a 15-inch MacBook Pro, like 2400 bucks. Got stolen. Um, really wasn't super upset about it. I just kind of realized that like it was really weird like whenever there's things that I feel like a lot of people really get upset about I tend to try to do the opposite or I kind of just almost involuntarily do the opposite so anyway I wasn't like super upset that it got stolen I was really pissed though about my videos and my photos and stuff that I didn't have saved anywhere um, a lot of them are posted some of the videos obviously are posted on here YouTube um, some of the video or some of the photos I had posted here and there but there was stuff that wasn't really uh, it wasn't really interesting to other people but it was like it was my video like you know my photos so it meant stuff to me I was really pissed about that um, so that was in April that the laptop got stolen um, so I kind of messed around a little bit up there and then I went back to my parents house which is like right dead center in Georgia um, for June, let's see no June July and most of August um, it was hot as crap oh my gosh and the humidity it was it was retarded um, I think it was like 90 one time I took a picture, it was like 98 degrees and the humidity made it like 109 or something. I think I got a picture of that. Um, oh, speaking of pictures, I'm going to try to link the uh, the Google um, Picasso albums. I'll link them like here or here, wherever they go. Um, I'll try to link them on the video so when I'm talking about a place I went, you can click on it and check out the photos. Um, so, let's see. So yeah, went to Georgia, um, or went back home to my parents' house for the summer. Then when the fall started coming in, I went back up uh, to Carrollton area for a while. Kind of the, It's kind of the rock climbing season because I'm into rock climbing. So it's cool weather, you know, we did a little bit of that here and there. And then I decided to go visit my buddy Ryan and he's in Boone, North Carolina. So I headed to Boone, um, was planning to stay a week with him. While I was there, I actually met a guy on Craigslist named Howard. So he, he needed some work done, done some work from him, and I was kind of telling him like, you know, hey, I want to do something with rock climbing. I'm really not feeling web design stuff. So he randomly just finds this job on rockclimbing.com that has um, an ad basically for a web designer for a rock climbing company. It wasn't for rockclimbing.com. So I was like, well, hell yeah, I'll reply to that. So I applied to it, did like two or three interviews, um, then I went to Boston area, which is where Howard is. He actually paid for me to drive. I well, paid for my gas to drive up there. Um, I think I got some videos too. I ran out of gas twice on the way there because my gas tank uh, sending unit quit working. So I'll post those videos too in pictures. Um, and uh, so anyway, I get up there and hang out with him and actually had the last interview with this company while I was in Arlington, not Boston. And uh, got the job, so I was like, sweet. So the job is in Costa Mesa, which is like Southern California, about an hour and a half above San Diego or Mexico, which is where I'm at now. Um, so I got the job, and uh, I went back home in, for the holidays in December, Christmas, and um, at January 10th, I think, I moved, January 7th, I left Georgia, and I drove out here to California, so it was like my second trip out west. Um, which is cool, but I came out here for a job, so it's been pretty cool. And the job hasn't really worked out. Um, I ended up doing a lot of secretarial type stuff, um, spreadsheets, and and uh, kind of I don't know, just like miscellaneous stuff that I didn't really enjoy doing. And me and the me and the boss man, we don't work together well. We don't we get along, but we just don't really work together that well. So I think I'm going to be put back on uh, freelance with them, which will be cool because I can still travel and. Um, while I'm traveling, obviously I'm not paying rent, which rent here is $650. It's not bad for here, but $650 when you're getting paid what I'm getting paid per hour salary, it's like it's a big chunk out of your out of your paycheck. So um, that's kind of like an update of where what's happened since last video. So that gets rid of all of this here. Oops, it's not writing. All right, so now what's going on? Um, lately, I've been into 
trying to eat better. Let me see how long this video is. I feel like it's way long. Oh, we're good. We're at five minutes. All right, so lately I've been trying to eat better. We had this couch surfer come who was like really into raw foods and really natural living. He's actually the one that got me into going barefoot. Um, today is day 16 that I have been going barefoot. Um, the pads right here are starting to get rough a little bit in here. I can actually run on them. I've been out in the yard today. That's why it's kind of, uh, looks really weird. That's why it looks dirty. But um, anyway, so he got me kind of into that. And this was like to be more physically grounded, like electrically grounded to the earth, um, which is kind of cool. I don't really, I definitely haven't really noticed any difference in just like from being barefoot. I like it, obviously, um, growing up in the country, like it feels better when you walk through grass or anywhere, even on cement and stuff. But um, my balance is getting a lot better. My feet are getting tough. I can actually run on them a little bit now. Um, it really works your calves though. Like my calves were killing me the first four or five days. Um, so anyway, if you check out video number, let's see, yeah, video number six, whoops. Right here, uh, a day with, one day without shoes. It was actually started by Tom's, a company that makes shoes. Um, so that was April 5th, and today is April 21st, and I still haven't worn shoes, so pretty cool. Um, workstation, let's see. So I bought this desk and chair at Ikea for 47 bucks. Figured if I was going to be freelancing at the house a lot, I um, might as well get something comfortable to work on, and I saved the receipt. Because I'm going to take it back if it don't work, or actually if nobody wants it when I move out of here. Um, I'm taking it back to Ikea. So anyway, yeah, here's my room. All my laundry's out. Um, I'm actually thinking about taking this mattress and flipping it up sideways and build like a fort in there, which will be cool. I'm still sleeping on this pad, if you remember the Neo Air. Um, so I think I'm going to build a fort to sleep in, which will be pretty cool to do. Uh, let's see what's on the list now. Book. Yeah, I'm reading a book. Um, Squirrel Seeks Chipmunk by David Sedaris. It's pretty good. It's pretty funny. I don't really read that much, but it's pretty good. Um, Xterra Bus and Cow Surfing. Yeah, so I've got my Xterra for sale in 2005. I've got it for sale for 9800 bucks. I've got some extras. i got two roof racks, um, the Yakima roof racks on top, and I'm actually willing to probably give away um, one of the bikes I have too. But anyway, um, I'm going to sell it and buy a... I'm trying to get an 88, 89, or 90... Uh, Volkswagen Vanagon, which is like basically the bus, you know, it's got the pop top. Um, I'll throw a picture of that on here too, or a link to one if I if I can find one. So I'm trying to get that because that'll be super cool to stay in. Um, be a lot easier to live in and work in and stand up and stretch and stuff like that than the Xterra. Let me grab my list before I forget. Um, so freelance and travel, yeah. So I'm trying to get back into that. Um, I'm trying to really make sure that I get my uh, my. Um, self-discipline and check you know and actually work and not goof around all the time um so let's see what else so yeah i'm just going to kind of show you the apartment i mean it's nothing special pretty cool this is the dining room which we obviously have nothing there kitchen stuff and uh, we kind of have a little wine selection going on we actually got into drinking wine quite a bit lately it's, it's been pretty cool this is jaeger j-a-g-e-r he's cool Oh, he loves it when you whisper his name for some reason. Um, super cool dog, though. He has a really cool personality. Um, and that's my roommate Noah's dog. Um, yeah, I don't know why he does this, but it's so funny. Oh, he just missed it. It's like he puts his hand over his ear, so he doesn't want to hear. Um, in the bathroom. So anyway, I'm out of here April 31st. I'm out of here in 10 days. Or April 30th. There's no 31st. So I'm out of here in 9 days. Um be traveling around and uh, I got a website coming I can't tell you the name of it yet but I'm actually build a website where I can have like my barefoot project things separate from travel videos separate from funny videos and kind of tips and stuff I've learned and what's going on a blog and all that stuff um, I've got a blog now I got a couple of website or a couple of pictures and stuff on different websites got a YouTube account got a Facebook account and all that but I'm gonna combine all of that into one thing um, so anyway, that's what's going on since the last video. That's what's going on now. Um, hopefully, pretty soon I'll sell the exterior and get a bus and uh, have a cool video for that. But uh, anyway, the next video I'm going to do, which will be number eight. This is number seven here. So number eight will actually be um, some of the things I've done since I've been in California. Like I've got some trips, cool pictures, cool videos, and stuff like that. So I'm gonna try to get uh, get on it today and actually edit a video to show you like where I've been. It's been pretty cool. So anyway, peace, guys.